Hello dear friends. Now, I went to go and see one of the best who done it movies I have seen in quite some time. That movie would be Knives Out. And by the time of this recording, I have seen the movie twice. This movie is absolutely brilliant. Um, the characters are so well written that I myself never noticed um, a lot of the um, underlining tension with a lot of the characters which I thought was brilliant writing. Uh, the basic storyline is a week before the head of the family played by the delightful Christopher Plummer um, died. Um, the coroner had put down it was a suicide but the investigative officers have asked for that particular thing to be not put it down. An investigation has been has been opened. We jump a week later, which is where the bulk of our movie takes place. And in comes in these three detectives, two local detectives one being a uber fan of plumber's work and just a normal doesn't really obviously doesn't really like the guy's work so much um but it's here on there and a another detective played brilliantly by Daniel Craig who by the way can definitely pull off the American accent and he has been brought in anonymously by a third party or an outside source which we do not know um, at the time of the start of the movie who it is which is one of the big questions that runs throughout the movie. Who asked Daniel to come and play? And throughout the main investigation, there is four possible suspects. A, we have Jamie Lee Curtis's husband. Now, that particular actor is famous for being a Scream Queen. Her mother is the original Scream Queen. We don't know Jamie Lee. She is best known for the work as part of the Halloween franchise. <laughs> which, by the way, I have seen a lot of the Halloweens, especially her particular um, entries into the series. So I do know Jamie Lee, she's a very good actor, whose husband has been having an affair behind her back. Suspect B, we have Tony Collette, who is Plummer's daughter-in-law, who has been double dipping into the family fortune saying that has been from one office saying that she hadn't got the money for her daughter's tuition but in actual fact she was getting the tuition for her daughter's education and pocketing the change episode suspect C would be Michael from the DC Extended Universe, better known to you and me as 
General Zod. Now, at the time of the party, he has been, how can I put it delicately? Being told that he cannot be the head of the publishing house that handles plumbers. Um, how can I put it? The publishing rights to all of plumbers novels. He is a novelist. And suspect D. Chris Evans, better known to you and me as Captain America, who pretty much found out that he also at the party that he has been disinherited and there's the lineup there's also in the mix uh, Chris Plummer's nurse now why am I bringing up the nurse character in particular she becomes a bit of Daniel Craig's second to help with the whole investigation. She plays a bit of an pivotal role in the whole craziness. That is all I am saying about that. But this movie is really well, well put together. Um, I kept on asking a lot of questions and for who done it that's pretty darn well that's absolutely brilliant that you know, I'm asking a lot of questions like why and how and all of that um, it's probably a good sign of a who done it that that will pop up um, the way that the characters were written and the scenarios were top, top notch. Um, we got a great cast, um, and I think this has got tons and tons of rewatchability. Um, I've given you the basic, the bare bones. Um, storyline and it's pretty much the storyline with a couple of bits taken out I think this is absolutely um, beautifully written beautifully acted beautifully directed um, as I said it keeps you questioning why and how uh, I find that's a great sign of um, all of that have you seen knives out and it ever came up with the bus um stickers but in my region which is all oh, sydney australia top notch it was a complete group shot with um i've seen on some posters is a magnifying glass with a knife handle the main people that I mentioned, Chris Evans, Michael, Tony, um, Jamie's husband, and I think the maid were all in that hour, in that um, magnifying glass, which I thought was beautifully done. And when I saw that, I was like, there's got to be something about that because half were in that are some half work which I thought was a brilliant um, marketing ploy I thought was brilliant so have you seen knives out please write down in the comment section below um, please like and subscribe and my next movie is definitely going to be in a planet far far and I shall see you then. Ciao.